another way is just adding five objects outside of border and setting all names and you I'm gonna use the team way now I'm gonna first of all I'm gonna go into teams teams is in here edit teams or it is in here somewhere here edit teams so I'm gonna check right there here and this is the team builder you can build teams here um, since there are many ways how you can build teams you can build teams here you can build objects and set those objects in teams you can also build five engineers and all those here and set create new team and put them in team but I don't want to create them I'm gonna spawn this team so first of all I know I will know that the team is player one team that those five units in other words let's say three engineers no I mean three infantry uh, in other words peacekeepers and one engineer and one talk let's make it this way so and I and these all five units belong to player one so I'm gonna click here player one and add new team now we have a new team here so this is the team name and I'm gonna name it um, backup the opener is player one and home position and all these kind of stuff you don't need to set them you can set the eye type or this kind of stuff but um, but th it doesn't really matter so I just gonna ignore these and I'm gonna go straight to here so first of all I select unit type this is the place where you choose who are in this team who actually isn't spawned yet so I'm gonna select that one is allied anti-infantry infantry here we go and I'm gonna set them to three and three in other words minimum maximum I don't know for what reason it is like this but I'm gonna set both three, three. so it ma it's make sure that if the both are tr both are three then there will spawn three peacekeepers now second one I'm gonna set a light engineer and I'm gonna set max and minimum to one now all a light engineer there is one a light engineer as well and I'm gonna set this one and one again and I'm gonna select this a light uh, scout infantry in other words a light dog now we have all five together three plus one plus one means five now there is another thing that you can do. You can pick of course by this way too that you go there and just select by this button but properties. You can set properties. You can set the experience level to max five. You can set upgrades for example if you want the unit to be heroic. I want let's say I want to be them to be heroic. I'm gonna just select these four. Now it's sure that they are heroic from the very beginning. And well let's say this one is Herrick as well engineer really doesn't matter now okay since they are then let's set this unit as well there we go and they are Herrick now well micromanager is usually for computer and um, you don't need this well I don't need this at the moment and there you can set description but I, I'm gonna skip that I don't need it there are also behavior and generic but I don't need this so I'm gonna skip this or the tutorial will be too long now we have a new team backup make sure you click OK because you want this to be true now there are team backup for sure now what I'm gonna do next I want to spawn this team what I created right now so first of all I need point where to spawn this team so right now I have two points start and end but point is one moment point is that um, I don't want it to put them it inside the border I want to put them outside of border so we're gonna create new waypoints waypoint tool and click somewhere outside and there we go it is waypoint 3 and I'm gonna call it spawn I have always called this spawn. 
Okay, now it messed it up. Here we go. Now it is spawn, and this is place where I gonna spawn this infantry team. So there we go. Now we go back to our beautiful edit script tool, and we're gonna create. I'm gonna create new script since it is spawning, and all this is from the very beginning. I could cannot it from here too, but since this is other story, I'm gonna create new script so it will be much understandable. So since I want this to happen from the very beginning, I'm gonna leave this to true. And action is true. I'm gonna edit this one. Now this one, I, this time I want to edit it. I'm gonna just edit, push edit. So it will edit this one. And now about this, we want to spawn team. What we created. So it won't be object type. It won't be player. It will be team. Now I want to spawn it. In other words, it's spawn, build, or merge. Click here. And now I want to. I don't want to start building team. I want to spawn team. So this is two choices. I can spawn team at location, in other words where this waypoint is, or I can spawn team to named object position, like near the near the bomber. But I don't want that as well. I want them to be in that point what is outside of border. So we're gonna choose this one. And now spawn intents of team. Now I click here and I'm gonna choose the team. And I'm gonna choose that backup team what they created. Here we go. Player one backup. And okay. Now at waypoint. I wanna spawn that at the waypoint what is here. There we go. Waypoints. And spawn. Okay. Now spawn intense player one back up at waypoint spawn. Okay. Now if it is true, it gonna be true it gonna do that. Now let's say that first it spawn team. Now I want this team to be inside plane, so I need to carry on it. But problem is I don't think it would be awesome that if the player gonna like go up. Maybe for you it is, but for me it isn't realistic that player got one gonna go and now infantry from outside of border gonna run. Oh wait plane, let me let me us see inside I, we want to go inside the plane. Nah, I would think they are already inside the plane. So I'm gonna create new one. And this is about object no, it's about team. We want team to carry some inside it. So go team and Carison. Now we don't want, like I told you already, Carison a named object with team or any of these. I want it to happen instantly. Carison named object instantly with team. I'm gonna click this one. Now I'm gonna select team, and team will be this backup team what I create be created before, and I'm gonna Carison with object Pomber. Okay. Now this back up kind of carry some with bomber okay and now this is gonna happen now like I told you before when there are scripts where are many things many action what gonna happen if that thing is true that condition is true then it gonna do in the or order of it is here so it gonna first spawn team and it gonna carry some after that so if this would be other side that this is up then it can't carry some instantly if this team hasn't even spawned yet. So this have to spawn first and then it's gonna carry some. Now it is okay. And now we have plane what is full of infantry and gonna follow the waypoint path to up here. Now we want to drop those infantry up here. So I'm gonna create now this is next thing. This is tutorial about areas. This is polygon tool and we want to create area 